What's up guys, welcome to Supercars of London and as you can tell from behind me, day one of the Dubai Adventures begins and I'm at Terminal 5 Heathrow to fly out with British Airways with Tim, Sam and Seb as we head off to Dubai and I'm just going to watch the planes take off here. Boarding pass, check, and now it is time to go through security, meet up with Sam, Tim and Seb are miles away, so they're, they're running late, but we're going to go through security and then get some breakfast because I'm starving. Bit of airplane shopping completed, and again there was a bit of a security <laughs> for you. issue for, you. <laughs> for me. Always. Basically, I thought that there was a, just a bunch of cables and charges in my hand luggage. I've got hard drives in here, and maybe that flagged it up, but no. My girlfriend bought me a bottle of Coke that I forgot to take out of my hand luggage, so I had 500 milliliters of Coke in my bag, which um, was not okay, apparently. So they took that away from me. So um, now we are in Giraffe, and getting some food, and waiting for Tim and Seb to arrive. Look at this artsy shot. Oh, I'm rolling. I basically. What's the what's the equipment that you have like on a steady cam? Steady cam. Steady cam. Ooh. Steady. This is really really healthy. You know, like. <laughs> Such a Chinese. Hey 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 hey. Hi. Won't find these at Toys R Us, folks. Oh, that's a. <laughs> that's a diss. That's a thing. Won't find this at Toys R Us. That's a diss. <laughs> Served. I'm currently watching Joe and Casper hit the road. What are you watching? Entourage. Entourage. <laughs> where's, your, where's your food? I don't need food. Sam doesn't need food on a plate. <laughs> Why is everyone saying this is like the weirdest thing? Ever? Everyone else is eating. Look. I know, weirdos. Enjoy your food first, though. <laughs> I know. You can, amazing. you can just tell that this place is incredible. You can tell just by the floor how many supercars this place has. <laughs> I do feel like there are supercars, or there should be supercars everywhere. So I'm keeping my eyes peeled and I'm car spotting all the time. Every car in Dubai is supercar. Why not? I wish that was the case. There is a, a Volvo on Dubai plates. We've got a Mitsubishi on Abu Dhabi plates. This is cool seeing so many cars on Arab plates. <laughs> I'm loving this. The true London spotter coming out. Yeah. So we are walking through the airport car park to pick up our two cars, thanks to Cadillac, which is the brand new ATSV and CTSV. I can't wait to see them. Um, 
nice Range Rover apparently, so she said. Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing them. Oh, I think I've just found one. Oh, look at this. What a beast. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> this thing is insane. Wow. This is aggressive. Oh, my God. This thing is cool. Carbon fiber. Carbon fiber. And then this is the ATSV. So how about this? For two cars, whilst we're out here, oh, I don't wanna get run over there, but, oh, or run over here, Woo, I'm getting run over everywhere. So we're just getting all of the paperwork signed and just a bit of an introduction, cool, bit of an introduction. This is a turbocharged V6 in this car, and this is aimed at the BMW M3 M4. However, this is not available in the UK, it is available worldwide, just not in the UK. And then this beast, the CTSV, is kind of like the BMW M5 E63 rival, and it has got a V8. And this is what I'm going to be driving first. That, and you can tell <laughs> by just how much bigger it is and how much road presence it has. And I'm surprised and amazed at how much carbon fiber these two cars have. Front splitters, rear diffuser, carbon inlays on the bonnet. These cars are really, really cool looking. Of course. Now it's time to remote start the ATSV. So I've got the key here, four buttons. Now when the car's locked, you do so by pressing and holding this button. And it comes into life. That's quite fun. It's not something that you can So we've got the lovely representative from Cadillac now going to talk us through the car. A supercharged V8, 6.2 litres. No, 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 rev it now. Rev it. Wait, wait, how do I, I just want to make sure I'm not going to roll into someone. That was hardly anything as well. Rev it again. <laughs> I can't believe we're in Dubai. This is insane. There's the airport. I really love it here. Yeah, this is so cool. We are in a supercharged 6.2 litre V8. Let's hear it. Whoa. That wine is unbelievable. It's now, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> to the road stuff, but my camera hasn't zoomed in enough. It's one of those weird little, do you know what I mean? Oh, he's gone. Play with Prowler. Oh, where am I should all go? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, supercars. We are here. here. Woohoo. Is that a final edition? It's I got a roof scoop. It's got a roof scoop, but that's like the only mod part, nothing else. 
I think five. This is where we're going to be staying for seven days. Uh, found another light. Whoa! Oh, cool. Oh, this is cool. cool. Camera section. Well, whoa. whoa! This is <laughs> massive. This is the perfect time for me to end my vlog. Tomorrow I'm going to be doing a full house tour, views, every single room in this house, a bit like what I did with Seb's house, plus the car park and garage tour as well. So I'm going to leave that here. Make sure that you subscribe and I will look forward to seeing you tomorrow with all of these guys as they explore <laughs> what we have here for seven days. So. Uh, um, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this video of our travels to Dubai and the next seven days are certainly going to be interesting. So make sure that you subscribe to this channel and also the three other guys as well. Link in the description. I will see you tomorrow. So much traction that I never had before. I go around this corner, I feel like I can just hold the throttle.